I am a master's student at university level. I've been taught that you can build this way. You can make the figure like that, full figure, and then, well, of course, this one broke, and I'm already kind of like trying to just do structure to build on carbon like this with this, you know. But the thing is, in my opinion, in my perspective, this is the stupidest way to build for me. You have to carve all this on your knees. It takes forever to make a hole in there and get all this clay out. There is no way in the world that I'm ever building anything like this. There's much more efficient ways to build. And the way to build is take three sticks like this and put them in the center and weevil them so they're not tied into the clay. You don't need no paper or nothing. You just need three of them. I have one, two here, one here and two more that I just took off, see? Look at that. So put three sticks in the center and wiggle them so it creates an open space so they're not trapped into the clay. Put wet clay around them and make a style like the height of your sculpture that you want. So make like a, let me put this to the side. Build like a, like a, thing like that, like a tube, open to the center, to here, to the height of what you need. Then let it dry a little bit till it gets like hard dry so you will hold your thing. Make sure you have a few openings on it, like little holes on it in different places. So that like around here, like every foot, you know, we have one here, one here, one here, like every foot in different size. So the thing can bend and the air won't trap and spoil the clay when it's getting cooked. Then after you have your center, like, like this, I'll show you, with one hand. After you have your center done like this, like that, let's say, then you're gonna build things like, to, to create a structure, you're gonna build things like, like this, you're gonna attach things like that to it. Like another one. All, all over. See, like that. You're gonna build like things like this, see? All, of, all over and around. Like one here, one here, one here, and then into one in the other side, like that. At the same, you can put them at the same, same place, or you can put one here and the other one in the middle of it. Like if I have that one, I could build the other one. Let me see, you know, it's kind of hard to hold this and do it too. But you could build the other one in the middle, see? Like starting right here. And then it would it would be right here, see? And right there. So they could be matching symmetrically or interwining, whichever way. And then you can do another one here. On the back and the forth, like in the four directions. Here and here. So you're making like two crosses. And then you're going you can build it straight or you can build like this sideways like that the thing is create you know like they say the strongest the arch the romans use the arch because they say it's very small weight so you can make arches like that thing is do them here and here and then once you have that that's the skeleton that will support your structure once it gets dry hard not totally dry but even if it's dry you can wet the clay Spray it, wet it, and then use very wet clay. This clay, wet it, like glue. It's gotta be really wet. And when you put wet clay against dry clay, it wets the clay. You don't even have to wet the clay and make little lines and all that. And people say, I come from Guatemala when we build by the river and we don't be doing all these methodical little things. You can do them when the clay is really hard. You probably might need it. But when it's kind of hot wet like this one, you just put real wet clay in the middle and then you attach the next piece. And that's all there is to it. I hope this helps anybody else in the world not to have to do this mess because it makes a mess in the carpet and everything else. And it's not necessary. That's, you know, I can't believe that. I've been around the sculptures and they say to do this. Now, the reason they say to do, be like this is because they cannot build like in layers, like me, you know, you, they cannot visualize a body, the outside part, without doing the inside. They can only compress 
to do the whole thing, so they don't have the ability to do legs, and I do, you know, like, you can do the outside to make a skeleton. Some people can't, so they're gonna have to do this, but it's gonna be like, gonna take, and besides, you can't let this dry with wood clay inside, so you have to put a fan for it to dry, so, there. <laughs>